Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice algebra problem? Solution from here. From what is given here, let's take 2 over 7 to the left hand side, and we have x squared minus x cubed, then minus 2 over 27 equals to 0 from here. And next step, we can rewrite minus 2 over 27 as minus 3 over 27 plus 1 over 27 that is yeah minus 3 over 27 same thing as to the lowest fraction that's minus 1 over 9 then plus 1 over 27 then it implies we can write minus 2 over 27 as minus 1 over 9 plus 1 over 27. Then this equation here becomes x squared minus x cubed minus 1 over 9 plus 1 over 27. Then equals to 0 from here. Then also from what we have, 1 over 9 is same thing as 1 over 3 square and then uh, since 1 can be written as 1 square this same thing as 1 over 3 or square and also 1 over 27 can be written as 1 over 3 raised to power 3 and here yeah, 1 also can be written as 1 raised to power 3 which implies this is 1 over 3 or raised to power 3 then we can write this equation now and this becomes x square minus x cube then minus 1 over 3 all square then plus 1 over 3 all cube then equals to 0 from here then from here let's bring the squares together and they keep together here we have x square minus 1 over 3 square now then we have minus x cube plus 1 over 3 cube then equals to 0 from here that is here let's factor minus out from what we have here then this equation becomes x square minus 1 over 3 all square then minus into bracket x cube then minus 1 over 3 cube close brackets then equals to 0 from here that is from what we have here we can also group this together from here then we have this together the first one here follows difference of two square from a square minus b square which can be written as a plus b into bracket a minus b then the second bracket here follow difference of two cube that is a cube minus b cube which can be written as a minus b then into bracket a square plus a b plus b square then when we follow what we have the first bracket here becomes x plus 1 over 3 into bracket then open bracket x minus 1 over 3 then minus following the second bracket here we have into bracket x minus 1 over 3 then open bracket x square plus x times 1 over 3 that's x over 3 then plus 1 over 3 all squared then close bracket which is equals to 0 from there then from here when we simplify further we have x minus 1 over 3 common here 
we can bring it out and we have x minus 1 over 3 out then inside this bracket what is left here is x plus 1 over 3 then we have minus into bracket x square plus x over 3 then plus yeah the same thing as 1 over 9 close bracket then close this bracket which is equals to 0 from here then also we can simplify this bracket further and minus open this bracket then we have x minus 1 over 3 here then open bracket x plus 1 over 3 then minus x square minus x over 3 minus 1 over 9 close brackets then equals to 0 from here and also when we rearrange here and collect the like terms this gives us x minus 1 over 3 into bracket open bracket here we have minus x square then x minus x over 3 here become plus 2x over 3 then also 1 over 3 minus 1 over 9 give us plus 2 over 9 plus brackets then equals to 0 from here which implies here we have two possible cases the first one we have x minus 1 over 3 equals to 0 or we have minus f square plus 2x over 3 plus 2 over 9 then equals to 0 from here and when we solve from here taking minus 1 over 3 there we have x equals to 1 over 3 so we have one value of x here then also here we can solve this quadratic equation first let's multiply through by minus and this becomes f square minus 2x over 3 then minus 2 over 9 equals to 0 from here then next step also multiply through by 9 to clear the fraction then this becomes 9x square then minus here we have 6x then minus 2 equals to 0 from here that is from what we have now we have a quadratic equation whereby a is equals to 9 c b is equals to minus 6 and c equals to minus 2 from the formula which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and here this becomes x equals to minus minus 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square minus 4 times 9 times minus 2 then over 2 times 9 and yes simplifying further we have x equals to minus times minus as plus so we have 6 plus or minus square root of minus 6 square as 36 then plus yeah is plus because minus times minus as plus so we have 72 from here over 18 then also we simplify this further and this becomes x equals to 6 plus or minus square root of we can factor 36 out here then we have 1 plus 2 left here then over 18 which also implies we have x equals to 6 plus or minus root 36 
times 3 over 18 and here we separate root 36 out and that's same thing as 6 so we have x equals to 6 plus or minus 6 root 3 over 18 from here and here yeah, 6 is common we factor it out so we have x equals to 6 into bracket 1 plus or minus root 3 over 18 and yes yeah, 6 goes here 1 6 goes here that's 3 so we have x equals to 1 plus or minus root 3 over 3 so also here yeah, it implies we have two values of x one is 1 plus root 3 over 3 and the other is 1 minus root 3 over 3 so all together here we have three solutions now the first one x1 equals to 1 over 3 x2 equals to 1 plus root 3 over 3 then x3 equals to 1 minus root 3 over 3 so here we have come to the end of this problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up see you in next class and bye for now